Here we got any mini mighty low. 143. 10, 16, 23. So I got the 24th, the 24th, the 24th. So how y'all doing? Uh, not too good. I, I had problems with the 25th and the 24th and the 25th share the same situation. So I got Detective Giorgio on the case, Miss Briggs and uh, Mr. Bullops. Detective Bullops. Are uh, you familiar with them three names? No, I said detectives at your district, the 24th and 25th. Do you know them? No, that's why I'm asking. They work different shifts. I, I, when you asked me how I was doing, I'm sharing with you. I'm dealing with the detectives. They're not helping me, sir. And they run, have control over the 24th and 25th, both districts. And y'all share the 24th. But y'all can't elaborate far as the detectives. But let's talk about the 24th then. On Epping Hilton, I got assaulted by Jose Chavez. Yes, that's the 24th district. Yes, sir. If it's not, then let's try G and Hilton. I got hit with a bat. Come on. I know. The 24th and the 25th. Epping Hilton. Epping Hilton is the 24th. I did. Y'all didn't do nothing for me. I got beef with internal affairs, me versus them. Right. So so who else do I report the officers to then? Because I can't do it with internal affairs, sir. I have paperwork that say me versus them, and I can show you in this phone, sir. You can make a complaint against All right. officers at the district or, again, like... No, I, I know you can turn them in anywhere, but it's still going to hit internal affairs, and I still have beef with them. I reported five them. cops in 21... Right. The five cops. I'm sorry. Let me just slow down a little bit. I'm a little nervous. I know y'all was conducting stuff, but I like y'all action, though. You know, y'all taking care. Of it. Yeah, y'all doing a real good job. Yeah, y'all keeping the drug dealers from over there. Y'all chasing them from away from there. Y'all doing real good. Y'all done made some arrests. I'm proud of y'all and happy for that. I feel safe. But I had stuff happen to me, and I learned. I have two years of statues still running. You can try like a private, you can hire a private lawyer and handle it that route. All right. I, I appreciate you, sir. Now, you didn't do nothing to me wrong. She didn't and you didn't. You know, I'm just searching, fishing, trying to find the next step because I can't go to internal affairs no more, sir. In November, last year, they threatened to lock me up. And then this year, August 16th, they called the whole second police district right there at Castro and Cotman, the second police district. They called them all on me. And I had a new report for Mr. Robinson of 63rd and Haverford. Yeah, he moved this bullet in my arm. If I take the jacket off, you'll see it. And went and gave me a complaint. I didn't get locked up or nothing. So I learned when officers do do what they do, they can still violate in the process. I learned that myself. But I had some stuff happen, sir. Around here. See? The 25th again. The guy shot at my foot. About 20 feet away. I know what 15 is for sure, though. I had to testify to 15 in dark. But I had a light and a light. So i say about 20. 20, if not 20, about 22, 23. Anyway, he shot at me. He shot at my feet. On Potter Street around here. And when he shot at my feet. I didn't even know he was shooting at me. My lady said, the guy shooting at your feet. I see the sparks. My dog ran down the street. He killed my dog. Two police officers run up. I said, the guy went that way. Me and my lady run to the guy house, showed them. Make a long story short, I seen the white shirts the next day before they put that building up right there. Yeah, I lived on Potter Street for seven years. So right there with Shelbourne, before they put that building up, I seen white shirts in the parking lot about three, four, maybe five of that morning and I came and asked them. You know I got shot at. What happened? They killed my dog. Oh, they wanted me to come double snitch. I said, I told y'all the first time. And, and here, here I go playing the same situation. Listen, sir. See? My tooth got knocked out by Rasul, sir. I just put my cane here. I've been shot before, sir. I told you. That's not a playing game. I got a bullet in my arm. I got a bullet in my spine. These hospitals don't even help me out. You know what I'm saying? So you was right. I, I can't get a paid lawyer. I don't have the money, though. 
waiting for my social security to come through and then we'd go from there. Yeah, I learned that trick. Good luck, sir. Well, luck don't have nothing to do with people holding them accountable. You know what I'm saying? Because if I did step wrong, y'all would hold me accountable. You know what I mean? But y'all didn't do nothing to me wrong. And I appreciate you. Thank you. Most cops, they run or don't want to have a conversation because I just throw so much stuff out there. See, this still broke. I'll give you the fist bump. I'm showing you this broke, sir. Right there. Do you see the knot? Yeah. Yes, sir. But on this hand, I got a little, little knot. Yeah. It's right here. That hurt more worse than a big one. You know, I got mace in my eyes. I got a lot of stuff, but. Yeah. And the commissioner, my last thing. I wrote Miss Hopewell up. She got canceled. Told you. She got an AID number. I dealt with AID before. Melinda Hopewell, 15th District. I wrote her up. And when I wrote her up, they played me. Like, in between time. Miss Mo, a little short white lady from the 15th District, told me get back with Eternal Fear. I got back with them. They got back with me. It took a long time, but the officer would counsel. Larry Kras, name was on the paperwork. Miss, Miss Outlaw. And that guy I seen last night on the news. Right. Oh, you know what? I told you this is good. I feel bad the officer got shot. Yes, and I, I prayed for him. Last night I prayed because I seen it on the news at the airport down there, right? And then they found the car down here, down Kensington. Yeah, the black, uh, what was it? The black, uh, the black Dodge. They found the black Dodge down here in Kensington. Yes, sir, I seen it on the news. I don't watch the news because I am on the news. But when the news do have some good stuff, so I prayed for that officer that got killed. The other one that got wounded. You, you, you know what I'm talking about, sir? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I got respect for the officers. And Mr. John Stanford. Yes, he's on my paperwork with Ms. Outlaw and Mr. Larry Krasner. Because I seen Mr. John Stanford for the first time. Yes, sir. He said he want all of us, you know, as family. See? So, officer, I'm just not a civilian. We family. Because that's what Mr. John Stanford said last night. As far as them two police officers, he said, yes, the city of Philadelphia is really hurt, and I'm from Philly. So guess what he said? We are a family, sir. So I got other part of the family that's not helping me, sir. Come on. Even Mr. John Stanford, who I seen for the first time, yes, sir. He is on my paperwork. Yep, with Miss Outlaw. Yes, I know. She retired. or re No, she resigned. Yes, sir. You see what I'm saying? I have a lot of people like this that retire or they just switch up and go somewhere else to work. Come on, sir. I know I'm going to heaven, sir. I know I'm going to heaven, sir. God bless you. That's, that, hey, that's better. I give you the fist bump. Thank you. God bless you too, sir. Because I'm tired of keep saying being safe. I've been trying to be safe. Look. I know you show me. Now I ain't show you this one, though. I try to be safe. See? Told you. They go bullet, sir. They go bullet. My second bullet. Come on. It's okay, though. I know I'm going to heaven. See, if I was locked up, I can't tell y'all this. It wouldn't be no good. I know an officer told me, sir. But thank you. You have a blessed day. You too. Y'all too. Yes, sir, what's your name? Silver. I never had no problems. Thank you, Mr. Silver. Thank you for hearing me out. You better than a counselor, sir. Hey, officer. You got some good boys and girls over here. God bless you, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, y'all watch your bodies. All right. That's the one for the day, I guess. We out. It's the wolf. We down K and A with it. Yeah, poison. Ooh. Happy Friday the 13th. I'm going to play Jason. I got some Halloween shit for y'all.